when you are one to five people, you don't really have to tell your story or tell the strategy of the company. They're all doing what you're doing. Once you get to around 15, you have to start verbalizing your strategy. Now you have to tell people, hey, we're going to go there. That's why this is important. You have to learn how to verbalize your strategy. Then once you cross around 20, you start getting managers and leaders. Now you have to lead through other leaders. And that creates a whole different level of complexity. Because now you start playing phone. You tell something to your leader and your leader distortions the message to the team members. So your leadership and your communication, you have to be way, way more clear and intention in your communication and your strategy so everyone will understand and will be aligned. And once you cross around the 250 mark, then you have enough management team, systems, processes, everything that you could kind of step aside and the team will run your operation without you. In the day-to-day, -day, you're there, just kind of a satellite around the organization, just making sure the organization is going in the right direction and bringing the innovation. So that's kind of how you have to evolve from being an entrepreneur to a leader, to a leader of leaders, to a CEO.